I didn't realize my microphone was off. Greetings, Cosmos, and welcome to Return to Yoshi's Island. So yesterday, I just kind of failed at everything and gave up. Today, I'm going to uh, try to win this race. Right, I need to do this thing first. I am pretty sure that I did not access this race the first time I uh, played all those years ago. Ha! Ah, like, I am pretty sure that either the race was actually inaccessible without two players, or I just couldn't figure it out. Probably the latter? But this segment was so easy to get to, I mean... Um, I don't know. Maybe this is one of those things that was changed for this version of the episode to unbreak the level. Alright, so. Racing time. I think I only made that jump because of my tail. Oh no! Get back here! Get back! Oh, hey. That shell just kind of disappeared. So I was meant to not have that shell for a little bit. No! Why? Hmm. Ah! Oh my. Okay, so I'm supposed to go up here and... Ah! Not die in lava. And then I'm supposed to go down here and also not die in lava. But I'm so far behind. Is it even possible to win this anymore? Wee. Yeah, I do not remember this at all. Oh my! And then I'm expected to dig here. Ah! No! I do not like this race. I do not like this race one bit. You weren't even close. Better luck next time. Well, that is... A crushing disappointment. Maybe I can try again? Nope, what the? Nope, I just start back here. Okay, well. That is a crushing di Wait, how do I escape this place? That, that the door that goes back isn't working. Well, it I guess it doesn't go back. The door that came from where the level started isn't working. No, I can't go in here. What am I supposed to do? This door isn't working. I, I'm stuck in a loop unless I cast myself into the abyss. That's it. I'm cheating that race just because of this. Just because of that segment where you are forced to cat. Forced to cast yourself into the abyss in order to escape. I mean, seriously. Why would you do that? Why would you force a player to cast themselves into the abyss after all of that?
I mean, you were thoughtful enough to make sure that I have enough unlimited mushrooms so I'm guaranteed to be able to get that red coin. That makes me think you knew that you couldn't get back once you uh, let once you entered this area. So, four cheats. Don't hurt me. A hippin' and a hoppin'. Sonic's too slow. Shadow Star. Redigate is cool. I'm going to outrace that thing on foot. Right, I need to keep it on screen though. Is the thing. Yeah, take that level design. <laughs> oh, what? I went too fast and lost it. I went too fast and lost. Well, isn't that glorious? You don't get to tell me I wasn't even close when, and then punish me for being too fast. I wish I could keep my leaf, but... The fact that that shell despawns so easily irritates me. But you know what? I'm not going to bother collecting the coins here. Alright, gotta keep that thing on the screen. Alright, gotta wait for that to crush stuff, and now we can move on with our lives. Alright, so... Whoa, okay, okay, almost went too fast there. Alright, so... Whoa! Yeah, when Sonic's too slow, you know you're in for a quick ride, a fast ride. You just build momentum. Darn it! Why is it so easy to despawn that thing? <sighs> I am still very upset about having to cast myself into the abyss. But, wow! Even cheating! Even cheating! That thing is... Difficult to do. Alright, so I can make it up here without a... Uh, um... something -ing. Without the tail. Oh, right. Alright, so I'm gonna try doing this at least moderately legitimately. No! No! Get back! Whew! Why didn't you despawn so easily this time? Woo! for you to move on. Alright, so, moving on. Woo! Take that. Now, don't hurt me. Sonic's too slow. A hippin' and a hoppin'. Shadow Star. Redigate is cool. 
What cheating? What are you talking about? I did that totally legit. What are you talking about? Alright, now for the main level. Now, now the weird thing is, unless the placement of Goombas was changed, Unless the placement of Goombas was changed, this level should not have been possible if my memory of it is accurate. And honestly, I'm not sure that it was, that it is. Maybe I was just really dumb when I tried this level. I mean, it's not impossible. I, I'm still really dumb when I play game Mario games today. I mean, just look at what happened there. Oh no! Get back, you! Get get away from you, monster! Wait, that that's the entire level if you're not running the races. That's the entire level if you're not running the races. And, and it leads back to here. Oh, this is the level that the entire game has been building up to. Oh. Er, I'm not tall enough to hit these. Yeah, the the eyes on Tap Tap always look to me like some kind of accent marks to accent its form, not to, you know, define it. Not to be its eyes. Alright, so. Moving further on. Yeah, this does seem like something straight out of Yoshi's Island. Only it's more like a boss corridor. Hmm. Great job, me. I kind of blame the level for that one for not giving me a power up. I hope it's in the middle. Okay. Okay. So it was my fault that I couldn't get the power up because I killed everything that could have gotten me that power. Yeah, look at that tap tap. That the red, the orange nose is totally its eye, and the eyes at the top. Why, Mario? If we're gonna work together, you need to jump. When I tell you that you need to jump. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh yeah, tap tap. Look at that. It just does not make sense to me with the eyes being on top. And yet here we are. Th that That's what's on. Ah! Uh, I do admit that that was my fault entirely. But this brings us back here where I died before due to my own poor performance. And, uh, turtles. Turtles. Turtles, why aren't you selling me stuff and helping me refine my weapons instead of, you know, killing me? Yeah, that's a super obscure reference. Oh, I like this music. Oh, that's not a power-up. That's not a power-up at all. <laughs> that's also not a power- There we are. At last. I liked how the levels in Yoshi's Island could uh, traverse so many different biomes, like... Um, or level types? Oh no, 
It's a monster. Get back, you! Get back from me, you foul beast. Oh, yeah, that was just per... That was glorious. Oh, and I'm only halfway through the level. Anyway, I was talking about something. Oh, right, Yoshi's Island and how the levels seem to go to a couple of different biomes. Like, um... Oh, gosh. I cannot remember the level name, but it's like World 2, level 6 or 7. Must have been 6, it was the top right one. Where you start out in an outdoors area where you uh, do a bunch of ground pounding in order to eventually get to a cave. I should have had that turtle work for me, darn it. Oh, that, that was great on my end. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh, right. Why? Darn it. Anyway, yeah, you start outdoors, ground pounding through stuff, and then you enter a cave, which is supposed to be the meat of the level, then you enter a very different sort of cave, which is just terrifying. And, uh... Um... And then you go outdoors, and there's... A very different outdoors area, where, uh... Um, I wish I could articulate myself, because this is a thing I want to talk about. Where there are fish, I think, that will just suck you in and swallow you whole if you, you give them the chance. Yes! You are a jerk who prevented me from ascending before. Anyway, yeah. It, it. So the second outdoors area was much more watery than the first, and that was really cool. These two are synced up. Uh, oh, okay, good. These lines are not the same length. That briefly terrified me, but someone was thoughtful enough to make sure that these lines are not the same length so as to make sure you don't get caught in an unwinnable scenario. We. Or, um, another example of a level that I liked was Touch Fuzzy Get Dizzy, where once you go through the segment with the fuzzies that make you all dizzy and stuff. Ow! Jerk! Anyway, with the fuzzies that make you all dizzy, you go to an area with some bridges that I did not know the first time I played, but you can ground pound your way through them in order to get to the coins below. And then there's the, uh... Yoshi's Island was loaded with bizarre secrets. Like, I remember... I remember Touch Fuzzy Get Dizzy in the ending segment. If you wanted all 20 red coins or something, if you wanted 100 points, I forget what exactly the last points were. Oh, thoughtful. But if you wanted all the points, you had to stand on top of a uh, tree branch? Question mark. And uh, jump in order to destroy an invisible block above the screen that um, held. It held something. Why isn't my brain telling you what it held? A spring ball? Yeah, a spring ball. That let you jump off the top of the screen into a secret sky area. And again, it had a secret sky area. Which was also really... Those broken blocks are blocks? What?
Hmm. Anyway, I was saying things about what I liked about Yoshi's Island. It was fun. It was a fun game, but it kicked my teeth in. Like, the final boss, right? For the final phase of the final boss, you have to hit him before he just crushes you to death. I was waiting for him to stabilize his position the first time I made it to him, and then he just killed me. Well, that was what this entire game has been building to, I think, so I don't see why I should have to go on. But here we are in a tropical paradise. Wait, that that block wasn't positioned where I thought it was. Block, you're a jerk. Darn you, Goomba. Well, that's an interesting gimmick, question mark? Boing, boing. I do like that tower of jumping, though. Hello, turtle. Let's be friends. Alright. No need to waste my shell on those blocks, then. Oh, for a second I thought that shell was going to come back and hit me in the face. Oh. That turtle's not going to throw a block at me. Good. As you can see, I'm very good at this level. Oh. What's with all these blocks teasing me? And taunting... Woo! And taunting me. This level certainly goes for variety with its enemy types. I don't know if that's good or bad, but it is. It is something. Oh. I should have just done a full jump instead of a spin jump. I mean, it, it, this, this level going for a variety with its enemy types is certainly not boring. It's. I've heard it usually. that's usually recommended that you... Stick to like three or four types of enemies, but like pick three or four types of enemies and build your level around that plus your gimmick or something. That's one way I've heard is a good way to make levels. But you know, if you restrict yourself to something like that, you you won't get this level. Ah, oh, I missed my chance to get a better power up. And now there are crabs here. I was going to go down there to smash those blocks, but there's no reason. I like this slower version. I think this is a slower version of the Yoshi's Island theme. I'm used to it being much faster. Well, maybe not much faster, but definitely faster and higher energy. Oh my, even slimes are here. I'm not sure what the objective with this level was, but it exists. It exists. Oh, that's scary. Hmm, I feel like there might be a secret exit or alternate exit if I take the lower path there. Fire is the key. Hey, Ninji. Ah. I love that that hammer entity is hanging on such huge blocks. These blocks are way too big for me, but you know what? I'm hanging out on them anyway. Mm -hmm. All right, so hello, turtle. Lend me your. Hey, get back here! I need your help. What are you even doing? You know, I don't even care anymore. Alright, so. Hiya. 
Well, I would love to go after those uh, blocks. I think I know myself well enough to know that if I try that, I will get myself injured. Now, there are two locations I can think of for where the secret exit might be. And I cannot say for sure that they are unrelated. Is this... Okay, that that's... That's just a crash block. That's just a break block. It doesn't matter. Boing. Boing. Wee. Power up. Boing. Boing. Alright, now I have all the power ups I could need for this level. I hope. I hope this level isn't going to require me to fly and then not give me a leaf. That'd be a real jerk move. Isn't that right, Greenfish? Hello, crab. Bye-bye, crab. Alright, so anyway. The, the first location I can think of that might lead to the secret exit is uh, where I saw that travel line down below. And the second location is by going under the boat. And there is nothing to say that these locations are entirely unrelated. You know? Yay, that fish jumped at just the right time for it. Yeah, see, here's the first place that I can think of where there might... Oh, I see what I'm supposed to do. I'm supposed to hop on this donut block and then ride the donut block down. That's clever. I like it. I think I've done it before. I just hadn't, you know, remembered it. Alright, so I'm going to assume that I need to go here. Alright, where am I now in relation to anything? Alright, so I think I was supposed to go the other way. I guess not. Ah! Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. This means so much to me. Wait, what am I doing? I cannot believe that I managed to get through that without getting injured. That's just so not like me. Alright, and yeah, that's the secret exit. Cool. Well, join me next time as I take the secret vine path down to that secret pipe. I'll see you then.